Alright, so we have two shovels, two axes, two nets, a ticket, a ladder, and a vaulting pole. And we've landed. The first thing you want to do is run around and clear everything out. You want to destroy all flowers, all rocks, all stumps, and all trees. Anywhere that bugs can spawn that you can get rid of, you want to minimize. As long as the flowers are picked, they will not spawn. Another bug you have to deal with, but there's no way to get around it, is the wharf roaches on the wharfs. You can't even drop items, they will spawn underneath them. And don't forget to destroy the rocks as well. So you do that by eating some fruit, and you can smash it with a shovel or an axe. And let the fun begin. So now what you're going to do is you're going to run around corner to corner, scare away any tiger beetles by simply running into them, and eventually the tarantulas will start spawning. Alright, so we got our first tarantula. It's chasing us. So then we can go to our little spot, hop in, and with good timing, catch your first tarantula. When you get into the holes, hold A immediately, because it's really easy to accidentally leave the holes, and then the tarantula will get you. Hey, there we are. We filled it up. There we are. If you can get a pace going of one tarantula per minute, you're doing pretty good. Here we go. You want to have your net in your hand for the tarantula to be attracted and start chasing you. So once it starts chasing you, run over to your little hiding area. I like to put the hole on this side so that way the tarantula gets caught over there. And there you go. Shout out to my new friend. And you know it's Brian. Yes, you know I'm playing it. Animal crossing in my pocket. Camp. I ain't throwing shade, okay damn baby, shout out Brian MP, 